Hello, everybody, and welcome to Town Meeting TV. Today, we're going to be interviewing some people on Church Street, Burlington residents, hopefully, about their favorite and least favorite parts about living in the city of Burlington. We're just going to see what kind of answers we get, what we can learn from that. I'm going to start here with my friend Avery, and you are a Burlington resident, as I understand. So first question for you, what is your favorite part about living in Burlington? Favorite? Um, probably just all the like local you know, stores and stuff nearby, plus the lake is right there on just you know a quick walk from my house um yeah <laughs> do you have a favorite store that's near your house um i don't think i have like any favorite stores in general but two that i just like going to are jake's that's like very near my house and then the city market that's pretty much right there <laughs> nice sounds very convenient and now I'm going to ask you, what is your least favorite part about Burlington? Or maybe just, doesn't have to be least favorite, but something that you just don't like as much. Uh, and this is comparing it to the rest of Vermont, because I know, like, realistic, this is kind of an unrealistic expectation, but uh, noise, just a lot of other places in Vermont, it's very quiet, you know, you don't hear someone walking past your window every, you know, five minutes. <laughs> uh, but... Yep. Nice. Well, thank you very much. And now I believe we're going to go interview some other folks over on Church Street. All right. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to ask you guys what your favorite and least favorite things are about Burlington. As I understand, you've only been here for a few hours. Is that right? Yes, that's correct. We just got here from Miami. We're here for the weekend. Oh, very nice. And so, uh, yeah, let's start with the positive, I guess. What, in your two hours here, <laughs> what has been your favorite thing about Burlington so far? Uh beautiful I, uh, so far very beautiful i love this uh this area walking around area and the uh, over by the water real re really nice everybody and the seems weather to be, the weather's great it's been yeah. great too weather's great so far yeah nice people yeah <laughs> the weather is definitely uh day dependent but today it's nice yeah. and uh don't hold back i'm not going to be offended but first two hours here what is your least favorite thing about burlington so far um parking parking that's it yeah we got a rental and um yeah it's it, uh, everything you you got to pay for meters everywhere so and they're they're pretty full so yeah, yeah. parking same yeah. <laughs> yeah it's a very good answer i am um, i also kind of struggle with parking around here it's a bit annoying well that's all the questions i had for you guys it's pretty quick so thank you so much for agreeing to this and yeah hope you guys have a great day Hi, so yeah, I was going to ask you your favorite thing about Burlington and your least favorite thing about Burlington. So starting with the positive, what's your favorite? Um, Church Street, um, all the little stores and stuff. And the least favorite is the homeless and the drugs and um, the lack of the police or city council protecting the people with that. Do you want to add anything more on, on your thoughts on like homeless and or what do you think could maybe solve that? Uh, I would like to see city council stop allowing all the drug use and the tenting in front of the library and um, maybe locking them up a little bit more. So I'm not sure what else they can do yeah. instead of just allowing it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, was well, there anything more you wanted to add? I was just going to do a quick interview. That's it. All right. Well, thank you so much for your time. Uh, yeah, so I'm just going to ask you what your favorite thing about living in Burlington is, or just being in Burlington if you don't live here, and your least favorite thing. So starting with the positive, what is your favorite thing about this city? Um, days like today, uh, when it's really nice out. There's so much to do outside, and um, it's a nice walkable city for the most part. Mm -hmm. And what is your least favorite thing? Don't Don't hold back. <laughs> Um, yeah, I mean, right now it's tough with housing. Um, there's not a lot of options. And definitely the amount of crime, it doesn't affect me directly, but definitely is something that you see around that I didn't used to see around Burlington. And do you have any thoughts on how we might be able to improve as a city in that area that you think is maybe less desirable or kind of weaker? Yeah, I mean, I, I'm really happy with... Um, our new mayor, Mulvaney Stanek's direction that she's heading in, I think putting more money into public safety is going to lead to the city being safer. Great. Well, that's all the questions I had. Do you want to share anything else? No, I'm 
I'm all set. That's, okay. that's all I have. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Have a great day. Yeah, you year old, and I came here with my kids and wife for 30 years, every year, twice, for the atmosphere, for everything. Mind you, there's not many people right now. It's very strange. But uh, it's often, yeah, when you have a special day here, musician and all that, we used to love that. And then Ben and Barry. Ben and Jerry. <laughs> yes, Ben and Jerry. Yeah. And uh, what is your least favorite thing about Burlington, if you had to choose? No, I don't have anything uh, that I can, no. No, no, I, no. <laughs> <laughs> Just like all of it? Because it's because it's historical for me. It's familial and all that. So, uh, and those days are guns. <laughs> Uh, would you like to tell me a little bit more about your connection to the city? Because I'm hearing it coming through a little bit in what you're talking about here. So if you could just talk about that more. Ah, uh, boy. There was a time when Canadian money was on par with American money. So we would come here for wool. My wife was a uh, knitters. And so we would buy... Uh, there were all kinds of stuff we would come every year systematically. And then we had uh, a little bean there that uh, we used to go gone now yeah. uh, no it was just an annual trip that was pleasant with all the three kids and all that actually I came here with my grandkid too once or twice <laughs> yeah great well thank you so much for sharing that's all the questions I had for you is there anything else you'd like to share uh, no I'll send you the bill some, at some point <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for your time have a great day Okay, is there, if you'd like to add now. I want to add the fact that I love Bernie Sanders, so we would come here a lot because he was representing here. When he was a mayor, we're going a long way back, and I still love him. Yeah. <laughs> That's the difference. You know, I think like he was saying, he used to come here with his family, mm -hmm. and I always used to come here with a few sisters and a dozen nieces and nephews and kids. Every summer we would take at least once the ferry from Port Kent mm. to Burlington. The, I'm very disappointed that the ferry from Bert Kent, Bert Port, Port Kent isn't going. Yeah. So, I really like Lake Champlain. I've never camped in Burlington, but when my kids were young, we really liked camping in any state park in this state. Yeah. They're great. So this place is lovely. And the ice cream, yes. and the bookstore. And Bernie Sanders. <laughs> well, yeah. Let's go. Anyway, it's it's just I don't know how many people come here nostalgically, but it gets to be a tradition. So here I am, two years later though, missed it last year. That's another story. <laughs> well, thank you so much for sharing. I really appreciate that. All right. Well, you have fun. Eh? Have a great day.